Yo, what's up YouTube? This is Gemmerick coming to you today with a brand new video, boys. And today, we're going to be going through and claiming up the Player of the Month point, talking about the Man of the Match packs, and then opening up a few Man of the Match packs. So let's get right into the video. So guys, welcome to another video on the channel, and today guys, like I said, what we're going to be doing is going through first and foremost and claiming up the man of the match, sorry, the player of the month point, uh, the second one for the month, and then what we're going to be doing is opening up maybe one or two man of the match packs on my main account, and then finishing off the video on my mini account by opening up maybe two or three more packs, so we'll probably open maybe four in total, we'll just see how it goes guys, we'll see how it goes. Um, now. First and foremost, guys, obviously I want to talk about uh, the Man of the Match packs. Um, I, I'm, I'm disappointed, you know. I, I am disappointed uh, in the fact that they aren't pullable in all packs. You know, they, they should be, man. They really should be. Last season, they were pullable in all coin packs and all promo packs. Um, even like, you know, remember those those packs that had uh, the, the trophies? What were they? The out of position packs. Who remember those out of position packs, man? They were so, so much fun. Um, you know, they were available in the, the 20k packs, that, uh, all of the packs guys, man of the match, were always pullable in all packs. Um, but this season guys, obviously, um, it is directly associated to one pack only. How do I feel about that? Like I said guys, I I'm not a fan of it. I really miss the, the thrill of just going through and, you know, ripping millions of coins of packs and just hoping to, to get it, you know, because for me, that, that's the whole that's the whole point of Ultimate Team and Ultimate Team based games is the thrill of opening coin packs, the thrill of opening packs and hoping to get something because, I mean, seriously, what is the point in those 35k packs that we have in the store right now? I've read stories of people opening, you know, over 5 million coins worth of packs and not getting anything, guys. There's seriously like little to no reason to open those packs. And I thought that potentially that the man of the match coming back to the game could have given valid validity to those packs once again because seriously it's it's really really like it, it, it was a great opportunity for EA to just throw the throw the uh, man of the match cards into those packs and just let people have fun. Let people waste their coins and you know have have a very 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 slim chance of packing it. Even if it's like a 0.0001% chance, just give us that chance, you know, because I, I, I personally, like I said, miss the thrill of opening up millions of coins, guys, and just, you know, not getting anything, but still knowing in my head that I have the chance of pulling something. Um, now, if we if we think about the, the timeline of coin packs this season, uh, we've had that 4 million coin pack for the Icon, which was our first coin pack in the game. Uh, the, then what we had guys is obviously the team of the year so we had two for midfield, two, de two for defense and uh, two for attackers. Going on from there we did have Carnival and Carnival we had uh, each four regions and then they refreshed again so we got a total of I think 16 coin packs uh, from that um, but not everybody got as far as the world I mean but yeah that's, that's another thing. Uh, and also what we had was the coin packs for Luna. Obviously we only got, I think, was it two packs? I can't remember. Uh, and also in Team of the Year we had the, the uh, 150k packs. Were they 100? No, 300k packs, I think. The all position ones. But yeah, we've had a very, very small variety of coin packs, you know, that have been sort of worth worthy of opening. Um, and yeah, like I said, guys, I think that this could have been a great opportunity for you know some goodwill between EA and the player base to just throw them into the coin packs or you know give us the option of purchasing one or two coin packs um, but unfortunately guys it is not the case now another thing that I wanted to quickly talk about is that I was actually reading on reddit sort of a proposition for um, how, to, how to fix this and sort of make it make it fun for everyone and it was actually really really interesting. Now, what now. I was reading guys was that um, one potential thing that could be looked at, like obviously guys this is all speculation and this is just all, you know, the community brainstorming effectively. 
Um, but yeah, what it said on, on Reddit, guys, I'll leave a link to uh, the full article in the comment section down below, or actually in the description. Um, but yeah, what it said was, sort of, what we could do is, or what EA could do, should I say, is that make the Man of the Match cards untradeable, um, but put them in the coin packs. Because if you guys look at the, the, the state of the game, you know, obviously there's a huge sort of coin imbalance going on at the moment. And, you know, obviously there's a lot of even base cards that are still still extinct to this day. I think that EA sort of have released all these FIFA point packs in hopes of bringing balance back to the market but it just hasn't happened guys it hasn't happened and i think that um sort of with regards to you know especially when i when i say it hasn't happened i'm saying it hasn't happened in relation to desirable elites like if you think of cards like you know chiellini suarez messi bale um you know deli ali uh even like anthony martial like a lot of these cards are very 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 expensive or extinct um, and yeah, like I said, I think that this preposition, proposition, sorry, would be absolutely fantastic. It would help bring back base elites into the game. It would um, also, you know, help sort of bring coins down in general from people because some people are sitting on hundreds of millions of coins, guys. Um, you know, and obviously I've got a, a whole bunch of coins, but I just don't, I don't want to upgrade my team. I want to, I'm still hoping to just open coin packs because... That's what I really miss doing, you know. I really miss opening coin packs, guys. I really, really do. Um, but yeah, that that's that was something very, very interesting. Uh, let me know your thoughts about that, guys, in the comment section down below. As always, I'm very, very interested in everybody's opinion amongst this community that we've created for ourselves. And guys, actually, we actually finally, finally, finally got a special card from my country, Wood. There. Um, so I'm I'm thinking about maybe training him. I'm not sure. I might mount Owen into him. Um, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. We'll see. I might do it on my mini account. We'll have to go through and think about that. Because on my mini account, I actually do have wood um, trained up to, I think, like 85. Um, so I might actually wait for him to become tradable and then purchase them off the market and then melt the base into a special and then see from there. But let's go through and claim up these uh, cards, guys. Now, this week, we've actually got a very, very, very nice variation of elite cards on offer. Um, I was thinking sort of for quite some time who I was going to go through and pick up But let's go through and have a look at this um, But first and foremost go through and claim up this 250k and the 200 team of the week points So let's see we've got plea we've got Tar, Rashford and Bashaway I was thinking about uh, plea but I'm going to just take Rashford in this, in this instance um, He will help me with regards to the English campaigns You know Rio and also um Owen, uh, but I may be even trading him, I'm not sure. But obviously, you know, I've got that Eden Hazard that I've got from preseason, and you know, I worked very, very hard for that. A lot of people worked very, very hard for that Eden Hazard, so I'm not sure if I will, um, you know, actually go through and train up Rashford, but we'll see, we'll see. But guys, let's go through and claim up this little node here, and then what we're going to be doing is going on to opening up some of the Man of the Match packs back and just looking at the coin pack so yeah like i said unfortunately not obtainable in the coin packs which is a shame it is a shame um and obviously not obtainable in the free pack either let's just quickly open this up um and then what we're going to be doing guys is opening up okay we actually get a gold card that's very very rare um i've never pulled an elite from the free pack have you guys let me know in the comment section down below let's go through and open up this one pack on my main account just to test our luck and then what we're going to be doing is going through and opening up two or three packs on my mini guys. So let's go. First and foremost, we don't get all that much. At least we're not getting our 70s and... Okay, as, as soon as I say that, we start getting them. Our 70s to 71s. Can we get anything big in this pack? What's it going to be? So we get another 71 and we get a 75 overall. So nothing in that pack, guys. I'm just going to jump over to my mini and then we'll we go. We are back, guys. So what we're going to be doing is opening up two packs first. If we get some good pulls, we may open up the third. But let's jump into this, guys. Let's jump into this. So we've got 76, 70, uh, Gary Rodriguez. Okay, we get Cheju. That's a nice pull. I'll take that. Um, Wanderson. Nothing else so far. Come on, EA. Let these packs be worth opening. And we get nothing in that pack, guys, unfortunately. Um, other than Cheju, not, not all that much to write home about. 
Let's go into the next pack and see what we get. If we don't get anything in this pack, guys, I'm not going to waste my time opening them because they're not worth it, to be honest. Like, it's all about, like, these packs, you know, it's just, it's a lottery, guys. It's all about chance. Okay, we get Abubakar. Nice card, nice card. He actually has the matchups. Okay, we get an Elite. We get Cuidado. And we get Chesney, guys. So two Elites in one pack. I'm going to open up one more because that was a nice pack. A 77 overall uh, and two Elites, guys. You know, you can't complain about that. You cannot complain about that. Let's go on to this pack. Can we see some purple paint? Has anybody seen anybody uh, pull any of the Man of, match, Man of the Match cards, um, you know, from these packs? Let me know in the comment section down below, guys. Or did you pull anything from these packs? Did you open any of them? Um, but unfortunately, guys, we do not get anything in the third pack. I'm not going to open any more, guys, because I, they're not worth it. They're just not worth it. Um, you know, it's, 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 it's not worth wasting your save FIFA points or especially if you if you buy FIFA points you know which I don't don't do it guys just don't don't waste your money or your save FIFA points on them because the chance is so slim uh, there we have Ben Yedda 30 mil um, at around cap so looks like a decent card actually I'd like to actually try him out maybe I could try him out um, we'll, we'll think about that and let's go through and check out Peter Check guys um, 91 overall can he be on the market? Let's see. Or is he extinct? He's 30 mil as well. He looks like a pretty decent card. And he's got a very, very good, um, you know, skill boost. But other than that, guys, this is pretty much just going to be the end of the video for today. Thank you all for everything and peace.